what's your message to the women? Because a lot of your a lot of your videos seem very much kind of aimed at guys. Yeah. I've got a property company. I've also, as you know, got a training company. Fifty yeah. percent of my customers yeah. are women. Good. Killing it Good. in property. Absolutely. Absolutely smashing it. Yeah. My wife is my business partner. Amazing. We've been married eight years happily. My wife is my business partner. Don't they say don't mix business and relationships? You fucked up. <laughs> my wife is my business partner. And, in, and if we don't have a prenup, when we divorce eventually, which is going to happen in the next 30 years, well, she's going to own everything. You fucked up, Samuel Leeds. You fucked up. That's the number one rule. You don't do business in a relationship, and you damn sure don't marry your business with your fucking wife unless you have a prenup or something because you're fucked. She's going to drill a hole in your fucking ass, and you're going to have to beg for mercy to hope she gives you back your fucking property, your equity, and your everything you fucking worked hard for. You fucked up, Samuel Leeds. All respect to your wife. I hope she would never do that to you. I would truly hope she never does you dirty like that. I mean, there's no reason for any of that. It doesn't have to get too messy. You better not cheat on her. She will do you grisly. Be married. Perfect. Brilliant marriage. Yeah, good. She's helped me get a lot richer. Yeah. We're business partners. Amazing. Do you think that your message, and I know you're not this crazy person that the media make out, yeah. but do you not think that the way you are uh, you know, referring to women as bitches. Do I refer to women as bitches? Yes. You yes, do. you okay. do. Well, first things first. Let's talk about that. Yeah, let's talk if about I, it. If I make a joke or I say, oh, yeah, I, I can't. Even, you have to give me an example where I even say that because I don't think I say that publicly, but or I don't think I say that often. An example of where he called a woman a bitch. And I'm just saying. So some dude, some little pussy ass dude once said to me, yeah, but if it's next to your bed, what if you like upset a girl and she catches you cheating and gets a machete? What a and a little bit of context here. Andrew Tate is saying that. If Andrew Tate was sleeping with a woman and he had a machete beside his bed and the woman wanted to grab the machete and attack him with the machete, what would he do in the case of self-defense? This is what he would do in the case of self-defense. And he said he got a PhD in it. <laughs> slap the machete, slap her in her face, one hand, machete and then backhand. When I got my PhD, we had to practice if a girl comes at you, ah, ah, you cheated, you cheated. It's bang out the machete, boom in her face, and grip her up by the neck. Like, shut up, bitch, shut up, bitch, shut up, bitch, shut up. Now, granted, he said that a while back. He did say that, but he didn't call any woman specifically a bitch. So it kind of doesn't count. But he does refer to women as bitches. And I'm sure he does it more behind closed doors. But every rap song says women are bitches anyway. Like, uh, I'm not saying that it's okay to say. I'm not saying that I view women that way, but I'm... To sit here and say that I call women bitches when every single song on the radio is talking. I don't, I don't call women bitches anyway. I, I don't think I do. I, you'd have to give me a very specific example of that. I'm very sure I don't. Do you think that your attitude maybe, or the way that you come across towards women, is a little bit maybe insulting towards women? Or, you know, I'm, I know you inspire a lot of men. 50% yep. of my audience are women. And I want to train them up and empower them as well. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm mindful I, of... I understand. You understand I, what I'm saying? Yeah. I think people who watch my content in its long form understand that I talk about being a protector and a provider for women. Yeah, you do. And I truthfully believe that men and women are very different. Mm -hmm. I don't think we're the same. I think we're very different. Okay. I don't think one is better than the other. All right. I just think that the reason the world, a lot of the problems we're in today is based on the fact that we're forgetting that men and women are slightly different. Yeah. I think a lot of the problems can be brought back to that very simple point. I think women are better than men at a lot of things. I think men are better than women at some things. And that's what I say. Yeah. And I say in some scenarios, I would trust a man. And in some scenarios, I would trust a woman. And I don't believe they're interchangeable and exactly the same. And I think in most of the world, that's accepted as complete truth. In most of the world, they'll accept that a woman is better at this and a man is better at this. And if you work together, you're a perfect partnership and harmony. I don't mean to be disparaging or insulting to women, uh, but I will say the truth. I will tell the truth. I will, I will not sit and lie to the world. I'll say what I truly believe. I just think we do different things. And I think that that's how the world works in most of the world today. When it comes to business. Business, listen, men, men make money, women make money. Making women, making money is fine. Men have advantages, women have advantages. Business just proves my point further. The advantages that women have in business are different than the advantages men have in business. I knew when I was doing sales jobs, women who were very beautiful, who did fantastic in sales. They could use beauty and going on that. They could get all the appointments they wanted. Mm -hmm. 
Mm. Oh, it was hard for me to get a guy to come to dinner. They could get the dinner. Whoa, Andrew Tate, you was trying to get men to come to dinner with you. What? Appointments they wanted. Mm. Oh, it was hard for me to get a guy to come to dinner. They could get the dinners. They could get the dinners all day. I don't know how good they were at sales. They may not have been as good as some of the other people in the office, but they got so many more leads that they closed more. Her, advanta her advantages were different than the man's advantages, right? So saying that men and women are different is not disparaging or insulting to either one of them. There's been, I've been making videos on the internet for a long time. Sure, I, I can't sit here and honestly say, because I'm a professional, I don't lie. I can't sit here and honestly say I didn't say at some point, hey, this dickhead came in with his bitch da, 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 when I'm telling a story. I probably did say that. But I tell you, I insult men just as much, just the same. It's not gendered. I, yeah, I will say my, that. He does insult men. I say, this bitch was running her mouth. He does insult men just as much as he insults women. I probably if anything, that. if I anything, he insults men more. Hit. So it's not about man and woman. 